movies in Southern California. So maybe if things go well with Veronica, I'll visit a few studios. It might be good to branch out, you know? After all, life is long. Even though it's only been a year and a half, those days in Plymouth seem like centuries ago. But no matter how far that summer recedes into the past, I'll never forget it. How could I? It was the summer that truly tested me for the first time. It was the summer that showed me that consequences were real. It was the summer that provided me with some much needed course correction. It was the summer that made me who I was supposed to be. Who doesn't love celebration? That summer needs a big parade. Let's toast the joy and frustration and the memories that were made. A group of friends got together. If I listen, I can almost hear them say, Against all odds, we made the world take note. Against all odds, we seize the day. Something to remember, something they'll be talking about years from now. Let's give them something to remember, if anybody knows how. We know how. In order to live life with eyes wide open. Someone's gotta come along and make you see. On the spots of friends who try to change the world. Did I Know was a production of the Audio Drama Initiative. It starred Kurt Hugo Schneider as Sam and Laura Morano as Veronica. Jennifer Blood was JB. Alex Blue was Ellie. Casey Brebes was Scotty. Alexander Chaplin was Kat. E. Clayton Cornelius was Secunda. Richard Kind was Sam's father. Leslie Margarita was Lizzie. Patrick Page was Dr. Barrows. And Sam Suey was James. Other roles were performed by Lou Aronica, Robert Berendez, Marcy Heisler, and Mitchell Maxwell. Little Did I Know was directed by Marlo Hunter. The music was composed by Doug Besterman with lyrics by Dean Pitchford and Marcy Heisler. It was written by Lou Aronica and Johanna Besterman, based on the novel by Mitchell Maxwell. The sound design, edit, and mix was by Dave Hart. The musical director was Jeffrey Saber, the orchestrator was Michael Morris, and the copyist was Mike Castile. The casting director was Robin Karras. The general manager was Carl Vorwerk. The assistant director was Frank Galgano. The stage manager was Janae Bonick, and the general counsel was Robert Berendez. The show was recorded at Threshold Recording Studios in New York, and the music was mixed by Frank Wolf and Doug Besterman. For a complete list of credits, as well as production photos and more, visit audiodramainitiative.com. Hi, this is Lou from the Audio Drama Initiative. There's way more to the story than we could possibly fit in one audio drama. Fortunately, you can get the entire story in Mitchell Maxwell's novel, Little Did I Know. There you'll meet all of the characters that you've come to know here, plus a bunch of other characters, plus a whole lot of other action that we just didn't have enough time for. You can get the novel version of Little Did I Know right now from Apple Books. And while you're at it, download the cast album from Broadway Records. 
It's got all 22 songs from the show, and it's available right now from Apple Music. Thanks for listening, and please do us the favor of rating the show and leaving a review. And please, tell all your friends.